welcome back to Little Techie. Today I'll be showing you the um the the command prompt I made in um Scratch. Um, so let's open it and um Scratch. Okay, it's right here. Um, um, so let's start it. Um, here are all the commands in this one. So um, let's type one command. Um, let me see. Um, we can type. Um, let me type. Um, let me type something. Maybe multiply. Okay, six. And then like um it can it can multiply numbers, you can add, subtract, can round them, can find the absolute value of a number. Okay, good. So um yeah, they also have um different utilities here. Like they have switch they have um history. Let's try history. And it shows the last command you typed. Um so um they have this they have kill. Kill stops the thing. Also, many other things. Um, this actually has a startup sound. They have one print. Print. Um, it can say stuff. Okay, but let's see how it actually works. Um, here. Um, if this is looking overwhelming, um, I'll just explain it. So, um, and it has a startup sound. Um, the first one is help. Um, please, if when you type help, it will say please check description. It's like if answer, like um, the answer if you type it, like if we run this, run it again. And uh, if we type help, what it does, this over here is the answer. So if the answer is equal to help, then it will set the history to answer. And then we'll say please check description. That will do. Um, the history thing is pretty fast. It's less than a second. It's like maybe up um zero point zero 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 one seconds. But let's see. Um, please check description now. Um, add it says what number, and then we'll set the um, the variable to a. Then we'll set the variable b. Um, this actually you can switch it around. It doesn't really matter. Um. Next is if the answer is subtract, then we'll do the same thing: multiply, divide. And now, um, next is um, kill. Next is pick random number. Um, if you type that, it will choose it will choose a random number. Okay, so um, it chose a random number. So um, the the switch users um doesn't really. Um, do anything, but um, if we type it, users enter a switch users user one one just it doesn't do anything history um. Now, um, suppose we type um history there. So if it set history, um, it will set history to um this answer before um before this answer. Set the history to this answer, and when it says to history, that answer, then the history variable um variable um it will say it. So um that means it will technically just say whatever you set here. For the um, yeah um, the next one is um, kill kill just stops everything. Um, print a uh, print what it says um, then set history. It will set history, and then it will ask um ask um the difference between ask and say 
is um, if it's asked, you can actually give an answer to it. But if it's say, it, you cannot give an answer to it. So it's saying, what should I say? And then whatever um, whatever you said, um, it will it will log, it will type that in the answer variable, and then um, I say okay, and then we'll say that, and then we'll say the answer variable um, for two seconds. Um. So um, let's check the other ones. Yeah, so um, that's the terminal. That's it for today, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye. And that's all about my terminal.